Hi, it's Scott from Zoden Guitars with another build update. Uh, this one's my uh, Fender I've been working on, the um, the Floyd Rose model uh, that I was looking to relic. Um, the latest update is it's pretty much done. So I'll further ado, I'll open up the case. And here we are. What we're looking at here now is a Fender Floyd Rose model that has been heavily relicked by myself. Um, what I ended up doing, as you would have seen in the last video, that uh, I'd had a white coat of um, antique white put on the guitar. Uh, what did I end up doing? I'll just take it out of the case. What did I end up doing was getting some 60s tint lacquer and spraying that all over the guitar, uh, front and back, just to give it a yellow look. And then what I did was actually rub the lacquer back to the white and then put about four or five coats of um, clear uh, lacquer over the top of that. Um, and that's given her this beautiful aged uh, yellow look um, on the guitar. So uh, very, very pleased with the way it turned out. Um, sorry about the camera work. Uh, you see here, it's probably a heavy relic, I'd say, if, you, if you're looking at it. Um, I really have given it a bit of a work over, um, rubbed through down to the burst colour, uh, aged the wood, taken some chips and chunks out here and there, I've aged the scratch guard, I've actually even aged the uh, the thumb wheels on the uh, Floyd Rose just to make them look like they've been uh, uh, a bit more worn out, a bit used a bit uh, more often. Um, the neck, what I did with the neck. Um, so I did slightly age the neck, um, if you look here, uh, put some age spots on there, just some rub through and, and I aged it with some um, tea and then some steel wool and vinegar mix and it just makes it go grey when you when you put it on, it actually looks quite effective. Um, there's the back, I didn't go too hard on the back, um, I was going to go a real heavy relic and then I was kind of doing it, but how far do you go? Um, yeah, it's one of those ones you just have to make a call on as you're doing it. Um, see there, I didn't really do anything to the headstock. I just did darken up some of the bumps that were already on there. Um, I didn't put any further bumps on the actual neck. Yeah, so very, very pleased. It absolutely plays beautifully. The, the Seymour Duncan pickups are um, sensational. Very happy with it. So, um, yeah, my first... Uh, take on a custom shop fender strap and it's come out really really nice um yeah it's not really much more i can say on it other than um happy days and um, i'll be playing and keeping this one for a little while thanks